Hey guys, Etan Sutton here from Sunbros, bringing you a one minute build guide on Freya. The purpose of this build is to take advantage of Freya's amazing toolkit. This off tank build ensures that Freya can engage, deal tons of damage, and survive. First item we're going to take is Craze Reaper, which gives us a good amount of early game damage to help us farm faster, but also gives us a little bit of tankiness. The first passive, which gives us movement speed, is also key, considering we skip boots on Freya. Next item is Tooth of Greed, which greatly helps us with our sustainability, our survivability, and works great with Freya's second ability, Godspeed Strike. Our third item is our first tank item in Bloodthirsty King, which gives us obviously a ton of health and health regen, but the passive is key on Freya because of all her AoE damage, it procs often. Next I take the big boy damage item, Blade of Despair. This allows Freya to do a lot more damage, especially considering the passive is procced often. My fifth item is pretty key on Freya because she's always in on the action, and that's Cursed Helmet. Not only do we get awesome health from it, but we get an incredible passive on Freya which deals additional damage to all nearby enemy heroes. And our sixth and last item, Brute Force Breastplate, not only gives us more of that health that we're craving and armor, but gives us an incredible passive that gives us movement speed and physical attack every time we attack an enemy hero. This passive combined with the passives on Craze Reaper and Blade of Despair ensure that Freya always gets off to a very quick start in each fight. This build ensures that Freya has a very natural progression arc throughout the game. With this build, don't be surprised to finish atop the damage and damage taken board while making a huge difference in team fights. Thanks for watching the 1 minute build guide on Freya, and as always, until next time.